Synesthetic. for saying I will unplug the oxygen, which I will do as a leader, because people in the Alrado Park, people in Reika Park, everywhere during COVID, we were on the ground while some of the critics were chilling, watching Netflix and. You, you, we Mackenzie, you wouldn't, you wouldn't actually turn off the oxygen of a patient, though, regardless of where they're from. I mean, is that not just rhetoric? You wouldn't physically turn off the oxygen for a patient and let them die, surely? And I would do that. As a government official, I'm, I'm supposed to do that. If there's a South African and a Zimbabwean, and a Zimbabwean or the Mozambican is on oxygen, and here's a South African citizen born and bred in South Africa, I will turn that off as a leader and say, because that's my duty, to look, they, during Afghanistan, when, uh, when there was war in Afghanistan, we saw the U.S. jets coming in, only taking U.S. citizens, children were hanging on the plane, and I never criticized the U.S. government, because that's what government's supposed to do. So your answer is yes, I would turn off that oxygen, so that the South African can live. And in Zimbabwe, if there's uh, the a South African is on the oxygen pipe, I will never criticize the Zimbabwean leaders if they turn off the oxygen for South African because we have hospitals here. We've got budgets here. What is he doing there? He must have medical aid if you want to travel. We, when I travel, the first thing they need is a health insurance, uh, insurance um, certificate. We pay for insurance because if I need oxygen when I'm in Spain, I don't run the risk of people switching off because I'm paying for that. So I'm saying if an illegal foreigner is on the thing, I will physically turn it off. And you, you will allow them to die. You would willingly kill an illegal foreigner to save us in Africa. And that's what you're saying to me this morning. So what you are actually saying is that a uh, South African must die in their own country and an illegal foreigner must live. That's basically what you say. I am saying the opposite. Me and you are saying the same thing. You just choose which one should die and which one should not. I choose the South African to live. Breaking news, everyday news on Prince Mila Entertainment TV. Remember, guys, to like, share, comment, and follow, and turn on the notification bell so that you won't miss any of our new uploads that we do upload here. Yes, I'm gonna. Yes, this is uh, Geton McKenzie. Yes, uh, the man is saying that I can easily turn off uh, the oxygen of uh, illegal uh, Zimbabwean. Then I could put a South African on because uh, tenga chenge tenga my illegal immigrants. If you are if you are a foreigner uh, in a foreign country, you need to have a medical insurance that you pay and so that you get assisted wherever you travel. And so when I was saying, get it in the comment section. But ah, uh, je du je atina kwa tino enda ticha enda hedu cause these people have bad mind. And I am going to um. Zanu PF failed us for years and still in power it's time for change. Mungarukuti Varku Garaguzim no Tima Penzere Varkutora Rama Wani S A Zangwen Genaro Iji. Someone say Guti Awai T vote imi J S A Zangwe Naro Hazo Mucha Jure Gayenu Koy Sutiri Mum Zim Tugura Rama Wani and so guys that's the latest here. Keton McKenzie is uh is the M is the uh, mayor of Karu. Yes the mayor of Karu actually Yes, uh, I mean, uh, the one uh, my local uh, council seats uh, last time because of uh, this war immigration card. And uh, it's one of the smaller parties in South Africa who have been gaining my seats uh, in, um, in our local uh, authorities because of using the immigration card. I mean, for you, yeah, my foreigners, I'm a foreigner, i uh, my votes and so we're gonna see it again in 2024 for Cheta Man National Elections. Our Kutinya illegal immigrants doing a change of peace up a town and so uh, we're gonna keep in the loop. We're gonna keep in the loop uh, about any new information related to South Africa because at the moment uh, it's not looking good. By the time we shall reach December, uh, change times on all my videos. I turn on also my statements. Uh, and remember, what some people they really do take uh, these statements seriously, like for real. But I know one of the things I can do is TV. So when we talk some more, I mean, South Africa is different than Zimbabwe, but in South Africa, when we talk and they left and we saw them come out and we saw left that's the main reason why we now have small groups like when our operation to do la when our post south african first which are gaining momentum each and every day and so we're going to keep in the loop for getting any new information some people are saying we need to go back to zimbabwe 
and register and vote. And we are good. Iowa, single tier one to twenty thirty. Apana kwa tiri wenda Zimbabwe ndio nitu ya South Africa. Doma tore ya wangu. But it's not. We go join Zanzibar. It's good. As now we are Moshe. And so, daily news, breaking news, everyday news on Prince Melendez TV. Remember, guys, to like, share, comment, and follow. Bless up.